I'm Jenna Kim Jones, and this week I'm reviewing the movie Black Sheep. What? Huh? Never heard of it? You mean that really old comedy from 1996? That's what's great about Clearplay. It's not just for new movies, you can watch movies from your past as well. It's election season, so why not review a classic comedy about elections? I ran for an election once. Eighth grade president. I lost. It was a close one. I called for a recount, but I was denied. So. Okay, so here's what the movie's about. Mike Donnelly, played by Chris Farley, is a good-hearted guy with the best intentions, yet somehow it always comes off wrong. Basically, his older brother Al is running for governor of the state of Washington. Mike's not exactly good for Al's image, so the current corrupt governor uses Mike to her advantage and sets him up in some scandals. Al hires Steve, who's played by David Spade, to kind of babysit Mike while they get into a bunch of trouble, yada yada yada. Turns out they find out that the governor is corrupt. In the end, good conquers evil but Chris Farley falls down a lot in the process. Is this the best movie in the world? No, but it's funny. Is this a good movie for your kids? Sure. I'd say if they're over 10, yeah, it is. I had my filters for blasphemy and vulgarity set at a medium setting, and sex and nudity at a high setting. The movie was clean, it made sense, and most importantly, it was fun. If you love physical comedy, this is your movie. Chris Farley falls down a lot, and it is is—it's really funny. will enjoy this movie because it will remind them of the past and the days when SNL was funny. Kids will enjoy this movie because Chris Farley gets hit in the head a lot. So that's it. I'm Jenna Kim Jones. And you know what? I bet you or your friend already has Black Sheep on DVD. So this weekend, clear play it.